Hello, my name is Dr Broadhurst and I am Head of Science at Gillsborough Academy. I'd like to welcome you to this short presentation to give you a quick overview of science here at Gillsborough. Science is taught to all students in years 7 to 11. At Key Stage 3 we teach a variety of topics aimed to provide a good foundation in all the areas of science. At GCSE, science is divided into biology, chemistry and physics lessons. In Year 7, we spend time ensuring students develop skills in carrying out practicals using the specialist equipment we have here at Gillsborough. We teach a variety of topics that build on the science at Key Stage 2 and try to link the practical skills and investigations with the scientific theory they come across in the topics. For example, they will use microscopes to look at cells, electronics kits to study current and voltage in the electricity topic, and the use of Bunsen burners in the chemistry topics. All of our Key Stage 3 classes are taught by one or two science teachers who share the topic between them. In Year 8, we develop an understanding of the key areas by teaching topics that build on those the students have studied in Year 7. For example, the use of electricity to make electromagnets and the way cells and organs work together in gas exchange and digestion. We continue to develop practical and investigative skills, as well as introduce topics which may include discussion of the ethics of science and scientific careers. At Gillsborough, we follow the AQA Trilogy specification for combined science for the majority of students. That is worth two GCSEs. A number of students are selected to study the separate or triple route and eventually they will end up with three separate GCSEs in biology, chemistry and physics. All of our GCSE classes are taught by subject specialists, which allows us to share our enthusiasm for our specialist subjects with the students. We offer biology, chemistry and physics A-levels and the Applied Science BTEC, and we're very proud of the success of our students, not only academically, but also as independent learners who can go out into the world and be able to show how science has actually impacted their careers. We're keen to develop students' potentials, and if the situation allows, we encourage students to explore science further, maybe through projects or STEM activities. We aim to prepare students to take ownership of their own learning and support them with revision strategies and independent learning techniques that helps them to be the best that they can be. I hope you've enjoyed this presentation. If there are any questions, please can you send them to broadhurst at gillsborough.northants.sch.uk. We look forward to seeing you in person soon.